Hey guys, welcome back to Faster Than Light, the roguelike space simulation captain game where you take command of a spaceship like you see here and, uh, and pilot it across the universe away from the rebels because you're carrying vital inf info, intel, that's really crucial to, to, to the war and to the war effort against the rebels. So basically, uh, you've seen my other playthroughs of this and this time, again, we're going to be taking another stab at it. And this time, we're going to be having a Sipsco ship. So we're going to be calling it Shipsco. That's right. It's the ship. Sh it's the ship Shipsco. Beautiful, right? And obviously, who are we going to have as the crew of this fine metallic space monstrosity? Well, obviously me. There I am, Stin, up in up in your grill. Cruising through space, and obviously also the Sipster is my right-hand man, just just like just like at Sipsco, my my um, my chief underling. And uh, who are we gonna have as the last guy? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Who do you think, guys? Um, I don't know. I, I'm feeling maybe Nilesy. Yeah. So Nilesy. Oh, yeah. Now that's how you spell his name, guys, because I know he gets upset when people misspell his name. So that's how you spell it. Niles E, N I L E S Y. Right. So there we go. Stin, Sips, and Niles E, ready to rock. Let's bust our asses into space and let's just conquer the galaxy, guys. Gonna flip it up too easy because I'm a bit of a babby and a bit of a noob, and I want to live long. And I know you guys want long episodes, so I'm loving this game, loving what it's doing to you know. It's just so much fun. So. uh... Without further ado, let's jump in. The data you carry. Yes, we've read this about six times now. <laughs> hotkeys. You can charge or arm weapons by using the number hotkeys. Oh, I didn't know that. One to four for the weapon slots and uh, five to seven for the drones. Interesting. I've never used drones, actually. Maybe we'll get to a point where I can. That'd be quite cool. Right. So first things first, let's, let's check out the crew. We've got me, Sips and Nilesy. Now, Nilesy is obviously Scottish. And uh, just like Scotty, I think we're going to have to put him, uh, I want to say, in the engine room. But what do we really get for having a guy in the engine room? What's the bonus? Manning increases dodge chance. Ooh. Um, so do we want to, do we want, do we really want to man our engines? Dodge chance is cool, but I think, um, I think shield recharge is that much more important. So I'm going to put Nilesy on the shields. Get in there. Unpause it and get your ass to the shield room, Nilesy. Now, I'm not actually joined by Sips or Nilesy. So, from time to time, you may hear their voices, and it's just bits of audio that I've cut and pasted in from them. So, you know, a special treat. Hello, Shin. And let's head Sips over to the weapons room. You okay with that, Sips? Oh, okay. Good, good. Right, and obviously, me behind the wheel. Yeah. Pulling the sick moves, 180 donuts in space represent so let's take a look we've got 30 scrap and i don't think i want to bother buying any more scrap because we've pretty much got what we need right now if i was to buy any well let's take a look shields are quite cheap so I'm, I'll, I'll buy one one bar of shields right there yeah so now when uh wait hang on a sec why can't we power the shields a bit more requires system upgrade oh okay so we need to upgrade our system somehow to boost the shields. Okay. So let's jump. Let's get the hell out of dodge. Oh, and the nebula's quite soon in this. So let's let's head to the unvisited location first. Then we'll go through the nebula, and then we'll head towards the exit. Oh, a rebel automated scout floating near the beacon. Despite its pristine condition, it appears to be deactivated. Um Hmm. Well let's see. Attempt to download the ship's data stores, which will probably wake it up or don't risk activating it, and just strip the ship for any useful scrap. 11. Well, 11 is kind of shit. If we wake it up, we can blast it out of the sky. So I'm going to download the data. You are able to pull off... Uh, you are able to pull all of the ship's data about this sector. Your map has been updated. And we've got two fuel, two missiles, and 12 scrap. Wow. I was not expecting that. I was expecting a fight. Should we kill him anyway, guys? Oh yeah, prepare for battle. No, looks like we can't. Damn it. Yeah, no, we can't. Never mind. Never mind. Okay, well, let's jump out of here before he does wake up. Oh, 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 wow. Oh, wow. We, uh, we, we downloaded his data, so now we've got information on all of the jumps. 
fucking amazing. Oh, that's amazing. So we can head to the store. Then we'll head to the distress beacon. We can... Oh, what are these asteroid field detected in this location? So we can dodge the asteroid fields. And we can basically just skip all of the ships. So we... Uh, well, actually, we should, we should fight some ships. But we might find ships in these locations anyway. So let's just keep going until the rebels show up. And then we'll have to rethink our strategy, I think. So what's at the store? You find yourself surrounded by a group of mysterious alien vessels. They hail you and apparently have some valuable technology. Oh, yeah. That's what we want, guys. We want the valuable tech. Hire crew. Oh, we could hire crew. Oh, no. Oh, what can I sell first? Maybe I could sell the... I could sell something to get an extra crew member, but I don't know if I really want to. I wish I had more scrap, guys. I really wish I had more scrap. I can't sell any of my ammo. Oh, hmm. This is a real shame because I really want to buy Adnan a tra What's a tray you? Rockman? Oh my god, Rockman's here. The Rockmen of Rachnos 4 are rarely seen and are known for their fortitude. Immune to fire? What the fuck? So we can I could send this guy in to basically just put out fires and he will just park an extinguisher on that fire like a boss. Well, Okay, I won't do that. What else can I buy? Let's see. Fuel? I don't really need fuel. I've got enough for plenty of jumps, so I can wait with that. Missiles? Uh, I might run out of those, because I do like using missiles. So I'm going to buy, I think, two missiles. Other than that, I can't really afford much. So uh, I'm going to say goodbye to the aliens and uh, jump to light speed. Here we go. So let's head... Uh, ooh, if we go there, we, we if we go to the top left, we risk being caught by the rebels when they jump on the map. So I'm going to head to here, the unvisited location right here. Oh, look at this planet. Looks like a city planet of some kind, or a moon, maybe. You arrive at the next beacon, only to immediately be hailed by a small shuttle. Help us, we are being attacked by pirates. Well, shit, sons. We got this. Let's get in there, let's save these guys. Aid the civilian ship, you power up your weapons, and engage the pirate ship. Oh yeah, look at this mantis scout. Oh no, actually this thing looks pretty beasty, and I can't remember if I flicked it too easy or not, so I'm breaking it right here. Okay, continue and pause, instantly pause. Now what are we going to do guys? Let's check it out. they got shields, so I'll send a missile. Oh, what's that? Oh, they, they've got a crew teleporter, so we're going to have to be careful. I think we should probably take out... Oh, do I take that out first? Because I cannot, I cannot risk them boarding my uh, my ship. So I'm going to aim for the crew teleporter first and shoot the burst laser at their shield system. Now it will probably penetrate through their shields. So I should be okay. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. Intruders. Oh look at these guys. They're coming. They've already boarded my ship. How can they do that while well, the shields are up? Get in there. Kill that guy. Yeah. Yeah. Blast him. Save me. Save me Nilesy. Good job. Holy shit! Right, pause the game. What the hell is going on? I'm almost dead. Crap sticks. But so is this alien. I think we're going to take the alien out before I die. Now their shields are down. Their teleporter is down, so no more aliens are coming across. Sips is still in the weapons bay. So let's shoot a missile at their weapons. And then the burst laser at their pilot mechanism. So they're not going anywhere. Oh god, go on. Come on, kill him, kill him, kill him. Whew. Oh god, okay, yeah. So, I'm gonna get my ass to the med bay. ASAP. Niles, you can pilot the ship. Way. And we're good to go. Oh no! Their teleporter's back online, so I'm gonna have to take that out with the last burst laser shot. Come on. Oh crap! We're taking missile hits. Oh, but the pirate ship is toast. Oh yes. The pirate ship breaks apart. You hasten to contact the civilian ship. Let's do it. The ship you saved was badly damaged in the battle. Most of the crew accepts your offer to be dropped off at a nearby, st nearby station. One offers to join my crew. Yes. Yes, we've got a crew member. The survivor gets on board the ship. Well, who is this? Who is this new new member? Let's take a look. Luan T. What the hell? What the hell is Luan T? Some kind of weird alien dude. He hasn't got any levels in anything at all. Um, I would say he's probably American. I'd say he's from Texas. Well, yeah. I guess I'm going to put you in... Let's see. 
the engine room, because that's the only thing that needs manning right now. As soon as I'm back up to health, I'm going to get back into the pilot ship pilot seat. Nalzi, get back into the shields. Yeah. And it looks like we're good to go, guys. Yes! We've got Luan T. Excellent, excellent. Our first extra crew member. Right. So I don't really need to upgrade anything yet. So let's jump. Make the jump to light speed before the, before the rebels catch up. So let's see. Where are we now? We're there. Let's head to the distress beacon. And then we'll kind of skip these ship danger things. And then we're going to have to go through a couple, I think, to get to the exit. But that's okay, because we'll need the scrap that we get from killing these guys. And we might get some fat loot while we're doing it. So, okay. You follow the distress, be you follow the distress beacon to a small asteroid belt. You find a small ship struggling to manoeuvre through the field. They message you. Help! Our shields are down, and I don't know how much longer we can last. Try to shield their ship with yours and escort them out of the field. Don't risk our ship. Leave them to their fate. Well, look at our hull. Our hull is strong. So I'm going to say we'll do it. We're always about helping guys in need. And you try your best, but one stray rock hits a key structure in their ship, and it breaks apart in front of your eyes. Oh, no. Oh, Lord. You salvage what you can before leaving and try not to think about the lost crew. Oh, no. Oh, I'm devastated, but oh, scrap. Sweet. Let's go. No, in fact, let's check Let's check, sh check the ship and uh, let's see what we want to upgrade because I'm not sure, actually. I don't think we need to upgrade anything yet. So, um, powers your shields. Every shield bar can block one incoming shot. Upgrading increases bar count. Now, we've already upgraded the shield once, but... Oh, right, yeah. Okay, so if I upgrade it once more, we get two shield bars. So let's do that because shield is very important. There we go. And uh, accept. And we're going to power the shield. Not enough power. Oh, no, so we're going to have to buy reactor bits. Let's see. That's 20. 20 per bar, and we need two more. So, oh, it's going to be expensive. Let's hope we get some fat loot next time we jump. Okay, guys, engage. Let's head to... Oh, we can't head to that one there. We're going to have to go through... Oh, the asteroid field? Hmm. Well, let's do it. There's a ship there, but we can take him out if it, if it becomes an issue. So let's go. Oh, yeah. Prepare for battle. Asteroid field and a possible ship. There he is. You arrive in an asteroid belt to discover that a rebel automated scout has been stationed here. Prepare for a fight. Okay, guys, we're ready. Pausing the game. What are we going to do? Let's look at their ship. Wow, they've got no shields. So I'm just going to save my missiles and take out their weapon system with the... Uh... Oh, wow. They just took an asteroid hit as well. Cool, cool. Their, ship's, their ship's done for pretty much already. As soon as the laser charges, good old Sips there manning the console. Oh, missile. Missile away. Ooh. Well, we've been hit, but it's in a non-vital location, and one shot took out their ship. Wow. Their ship explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap. Sweet. Sweet. So we can afford, ooh, almost enough to, for our um, for our reactor upgrade, but uh, not quite. Well, it looks like the asteroid just stopped coming, so let's just uh, charge our FTL and jump to light speed. Engage. Right, where are we going to go? Let's head to the store, you know, guys. Or in fact, no, let's head to this one without any ships here, because there might be some fat loot just lying around in a crate. Who knows? Scanners are showing intelligent life forms on a nearby planet. No match for them can be found in the database. Oh, this is always a risk. Um, we've got four crew members now, though, so we can risk the possibility of losing one, because we could, we could, we could make first contact, guys, with a new race. This could be very exciting. You land a small shuttle in an enormous field whose only occupants are small, six-legged, horse-like animals. Could they be what your scans picked up? Now, do we... Oh, ho, ho, do we try to communicate peacefully? Or do we bring some of the creatures on board to sell? Ah, uh, I don't know. Oh, this is a tricky one. I'm going to go for the peaceful option. Try and communicate peacefully because they've got six legs. I mean, imagine a six-legged horse guy drop-kicking you. If these guys start drop-kicking us... We're gonna be we're gonna be screwed. You try to communicate in every possible way, but they just stand there, silently judging you with their large, expressionless eyes. <sighs> Great. That miss? What does it mean, miss? We're not taking any hit, any hits. Weird. Well, I guess we should have grabbed them to sell. Never mind. Let's head to the store. We could have sold them to the store as well. Damn. Oh well. A ship engineer has set up a small shop. Great. So let's check this out. Ion Blast. That's the only weapon we can afford. 
They haven't got any crew for sale. Ion weapons can disable systems without causing hull damage. Oh, cool. So we can basically just pin a guy down. That sounds pretty exciting. Let's buy... Hmm. Shield charge booster. Boost the, shields, the ship's recharge rate by 15%. Uh, I'm not so keen on that. Stealth weapons prevents your weapon fire from disrupting your cloak. Allowing to sh you to shoot at will while cloaked. I didn't even know you could get a cloak. But damn, that sounds powerful. Well, let's buy... Uh, let's see. I feel like I should actually save my money. Because uh, the Ion Blast doesn't look amazing. It looks good. But I'm not sure. Not sure. I'll buy it. I'll buy it. Because disabling a system is pretty sweet. So let's head to the ship. And the equipment. And there's the Ion Blast. So we can power that up if they have equipment that we want to take out without damaging the ship. Okay. Let's do it. Jump to light speed, guys. Oh, now we can't quite get to that bit yet. But we're going to have to head across here to the exit. So I'll go here. I think that way we can jump to the top right. Then we can jump to the, that one there. And then get to the exit before the rebels catch up. Okay. But be ready. Possible ship detected. Here we go. It's just an auto scout. No worries. So I'll, I'm going to try the Ion Blast. Not enough power. So let's deactivate the missiles. Activate the Ion Blast. And shoot it at their weapon system. Let's see what that does. What's the charge time on it? I don't know. But it's not quite as quick as the... Or is, oh no, it is. It's quicker than the burst laser. Sweet. It's better kill somebody in like one shot. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. We're taking hits. Heavy hits. But it's okay. The burst laser is charged. So let's just ice their weapon system. Oh, missed. But, oh, oh, they've got an Ion Blast as well. But luckily for us, their weapon system is completely down. That's great news. So the Ion Blast is back up. Let's shoot their pilot ship pilot. Oh. Shoot the weapons again. And they're toast. Excellent. It looks like it was an auto scout. So I don't think it was going to be able to surrender. Leaving behind a substantial collection of scrap, fuel, drone parts. Great. Let's jump. Get the hell out of here. 